Hey y'all, greetings. So this is going to be another read y'all, but I am strongly picking up well, energy. I don't know if I can say that on here you all, but we're just going to like trial and error, trial and error it. Um, but yeah, somebody has been having some sexual visions about you, okay? Somebody knows that you are like freakier than what you put off or something like that but something about sexual healing and I don't mean sexual healing in the whole like oh let's just feel good for like a couple of minutes and then boom we go back to feeling like our natural selves like no well not our natural but like our normal selves when we're not engaging in such energies like I feel like this is more so like a sexual energy that brings out the best within both of you know you and your divine masculine distorted masculine divine feminine distorted feminine energy so yeah we're gonna go ahead and delve deeper into the energies actually spirit divinely guided me to pull from the sexual tarot deck so <clears throat> let me go ahead and shuffle up this deck Ancestors, most high creator of all things, divine intelligence, Archangel Michael, please come on in. All right, with the divine healing aspects, okay, of what is currently going on at this particular time, We have the Queen of Pentacles, all right? The Queen of Pentacles. I feel like, ooh, there could be a Divine Feminine out there that is a bit undersatisfied. It's like the guys who you, not pick up, but like the guys that you come into acquaintance with, it's like they're very thirsty over you. It's like they give off an energy of like, never having a good thing before or never experiencing a good thing before like somebody is just too like I don't know what it is that you're seeking like I'm not saying you're into thugs or you're into players but it's like you're into someone who knows how to take control but like there is someone that is in your energy that is kind of like in their feminine energy could be a masculine and of course this isn't a negative thing but it's like you need like I don't know <laughs> why I'm here and you need some roughness okay somebody needs to give it to you rough okay you like it nice and rough all right um <laughs> oh my god sorry guys um <laughs> we have the six of swords though okay with this six of swords energy I feel like I don't know there's, I don't know, there's a lot of chemistry here. You know, this person feels for you deeply, you know. Um, we have the Nine of Wands in the reverse. I feel like, hmm, somebody could have, like, denied or rejected your intimacy in the past. They could have denied or rejected your closeness or your wanting to be closer to them. Yeah, King of Swords, yeah, because somebody was all about, like, the paper or all about their status, all about their material. Yeah, someone had, like, different girls or different women that they could choose from here. Yeah. <clears throat> there could have been a mother figure also in this equation that was, like, always putting things into this masculine's head, making this masculine think <clears throat> and inner know. Oh, there go my throat chakra. But yeah, like think and inner know certain things like about their lifestyle and made them think that they were higher than what they were at that present time. Okay, yeah, we have the seven of pentacles. Yeah, this masculine was definitely dealing with someone who sucked them dry, you know, someone who was very out for self, you know, very for themselves, you know, very materialistic, very, you know, wanting things to go their way. 
all right um spirit guides ancestors most high give me some more messages we have the the chariot yeah but somehow it's like this this masculine energy always looks on and thinks about this feminine energy that they could have again kicked to the curb or you know set to the side or you know placed in a box whatever the case was um but this energy is like they're very soft with you they're very in tune with you like somebody really knows or wants to know how to please your body like how to rock your body and how to really get you off in the way in which you desire to be let off like that's why i feel like a lot of you feminines out there you don't just have sex with just any old anyone if at all like i feel like a lot of you you know you just keep your sexual energy to yourself because what it is that you're seeking it's like energies that you could reciprocate energies that you could bring forth and it's like the energies that you were with prior in the past is like they were all about self they were all about getting off for themselves and like pleasuring themselves but like somebody got stuck with those energies as well and i feel like somebody wasn't like necessarily sexually pleasured by them but like they were more so pleasured by how they could have this person under their thumb or okay, okay or like wrapped around their finger all right so yeah we have the knight of swords exactly somebody was willing to do any old thing somebody was willing to perform in any old way all right somebody was willing to degrade themselves for this divine masculine i'm hearing threesome energy all right yeah look <laughs> this is the moon again something about an orgy there could have been an orgy that took place okay yeah and still none of that could even compare to the way you made this masculine or feminine energy feel it's like they had to do the extras to get off or to yeah release yeah and somebody is completely just enraged at you potentially being with someone else yeah somebody feels like they're gonna like catch you with someone else or they want to like i don't know persuade you into not being with someone else yeah because somebody wants to wine and dine you ace and pe ace of pentacles they want to give you their love yeah this empress this high priestess their love okay yeah we have the nine of pentacles here somebody does not want you to be single they, they're like look i know that you're single i know that you're self-sufficient i know that you're independent but please let me come in and help you somebody's like let me offer you my nine of wands okay what do we have bottom of the deck we have the stars okay yeah something about shining together with this energy is very significant okay yeah look i can't show i can't show those pictures but yeah there's there's a lot of sexual intimacy energy that is popping out like somebody is really they got the hots for you they got the skins for you they got the heat for you all right and a lot of you could be picking up on this but yeah so that is what i have for you guys collective if this has resonated in any way please be sure to like comment share and subscribe all right, if you aren't already, and until the next one, y'all.